Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about our design services. We're really having a lot of people inquire about our design services, so I kind of wanted to walk through the processes that we go through. I think people are understanding how complicated noise and treatment really are, and to get the, the best resolution you can, to get the highest and best use of your dollars that you can, you don't want to waste time and money. So you got to have a strategy. I've been saying this for 17 years. You got to know what your goals are. You got to take the appropriate tactics to achieve your goals. And a lot of people don't do that. People don't plan to fail. They fail to plan. With our design services, you're going to have a plan. You're going to have a track to run on. That's what's going to be critical. Noise and treatment. It's our two types. Noise is defined as sound coming into the room or leaving the room. That's noise transmission. Noise transmitting through the walls, transmitting from the outside into the room, okay? Treatment, that's managing the energy that stays in the room. Two different kinds of physics, vibrational and airborne energy. So we're managing the energy that stays in the room. The barrier that you build is a structure that you put between the source of the noise, garbage truck, and your listening room, as an example, okay? Source and receiver. So the barrier designed, and this is what people just do not understand. The barrier design is directly related to the noise numbers that you have. You can't just build anything that you think is going to work based on your opinion. This is physical science. You have to measure the frequency and the amplitude of the noise because every barrier is different. I was looking over our design projects, our noise projects for the last couple of years, and I think there were 42 different barriers that we used. Similar in some respects, drastically different in others, but all based upon the noise numbers the client took. And we guarantee all our noise results or you get your money back. I don't believe there's a company out there that does this. Ask around, search around. I want you to build me a room. I want a noise floor of X. See if they'll guarantee it. They'll laugh at you. Because they don't have, most don't have any idea how to deal with noise. Okay, noise nonsense, most of it. Barrier design is a ratio of the outside noise to how quiet we need it in the inside. There's ratios there that we have to go by. What noise floor do we want in our room? What's the usage? A vocal room? needs a lower noise floor, then maybe a mixing room. Needs a lower noise floor, then a two-channel playback or a theater. I don't know. What are your goals? It's not my goals. What are your goals? That's, that's what we're up to here. We're trying to figure it out. Here's a great example of why one barrier won't work. Barriers that are below 125 hertz are completely different than barriers for noise above 125 hertz. Voice bass, whatever you want to call it. They're completely different. That's why you got to measure. The old carpenter adage about measure twice, cut once, couldn't be more applicable in this situation. Treatment, low frequency, middle frequency, high frequency management through absorption, rate, and level. We don't talk a lot about diffusion. Most people don't have budgets for it, and most people don't meet the minimum requirements that diffusion requires. So they make their room sound worse and drain their bank account because diffusion is expensive. I mean, I was talking to the guys in the shop the other day. Our, one of our diffusers has 90 pieces. It takes a long time to assemble that. So they're expensive and finish each piece individually. So you have to know what you're doing. Our fees are $2,500 for treatment, $2,500 for noise. If you need them both, it's $4,500. But we give you a 50% credit towards our foam and carbon technologies that we'll spec into the design for you. So what are your net costs? I mean, let's talk business. $1,250 for each noise, $1,250 for treatment. That's your net cost. Do you believe that knowing what you're going to do will save you $1,250 in mistakes? I guarantee you it'll save you that much in mistake. From the way I see people proceeding constantly, bouncing around like pinballs in a machine, not knowing what they're going to do, they go one place and they, they do something. It doesn't work out, so they bounce to another place. That's crazy. 
is a waste of time. It's a waste of money. And both are very expensive. You can't, you can't waste neither of them. Shortest distance between two points is a straight line. The only way you get your straight line is to measure. We have apps. Download them on your phone. Follow our instructions. Take the noise measurements. Fill out the online form. It's painless. It's easy. People don't have any issues. We've done over 1,400 with these apps. So it's a time-tested, proven technique that works. And we provide the guarantee. You can't lose. If you're not willing to spend $1,250 to avoid those mistakes, then we probably can't help you. Just continue on guessing. And you'll continue on making more and more mistakes. That's the problem. Have a plan. Work the plan. Use tactics towards your strategy. Design services is kind of an overview of how we do it. I really hope this helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. And if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to. So please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple of days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis. So that'll help you. Thank you.